Well, today is the day. Today is Scones Day. Now, as you may know, Scones are from the UK, which is a small little island nation. And so I'm not qualified to do this, to make them. So I've brought in a guest chef from a small island nation that has no longer any proper formal relations with their mainland neighbors. And that would be uh, Taiwan. So my wife's going to be doing the cooking. My wife. All right, let's make scones. First, you get a nice package of premium mix. Pour it into a large bowl. Then, with three fourth cup of water, add it into the bowl. Mix. into a big lump. Then we are we we are placing the lumps onto the cooking sheet. Then it goes into the oven. Let's see. For 14 to 16 minutes, about 375 degrees Fahrenheit. It's ready to go in. Set the timer. 14 minutes. Well, I said 15. Average. We'll see. It's time to get a scone out. Do we need to bake more on this one? Never has scone before. Do you guys feel like you're baked? Maybe it's not doughy inside. But the doughs are not very thick either. Alright, I guess we're all good. Ready to serve the scone. Aren't they beautiful? Alright, I'm gonna try the scones now. Now, it's my understanding. Now I've got three things here. I've got uh, I've got butter because that seems far more logical to me. And if you don't know anything about Monty Python and the uh, the lumberjack song, you'd know, buttered scones for tea. Um, but we've also got the double Devon cream, aka clotted cream, the worst named food substance on the planet, next to a vomit cola, and strawberry preserves. So, first thing is, I understand you're supposed to split a scone, and it's unclear to me whether you're supposed to split it with a knife or a fork. So, I'm going to try a, a fork. That was a little small, so we're going to start with that. 
and it's uh, falling apart. And I just realized I don't have a plate to eat on, so um, thankfully the table is clean. <clears throat> now I might as well go for broke here and start with the clotted cream that I've never tasted in my life. It looks like a jar of mayonnaise. It smells like a jar of milk. Um, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna take a little. I'm just gonna try a little bit. All right, uh, yeah, all right. That's no, nothing like what I expected it to taste. All right, it does kind of taste like butter, mild butter. So I'm going to put this down first because that's the only thing that makes sense. Um, I'm going to try a bite with just the clotted cream. I know that's not right, but I'm just going to try it. That's all right. That's totally all right. Let's try the strawberry preserves because I love strawberry preserves and those smell like strawberry preserves now I understand some parts of the country put the strawberry preserves before the clotted cream but that's just nuts I don't know which ones do it that way but this is wrong because obviously you want the clotted cream to be in the butter in the scone That's perfectly fine. I have no complaint. I had a strong strawberry jam. But. But. But good. Alright. Scones. Clotted cream. Strawberry jam. Good. Good. Really good. I like it. 